What's up guys, Kidmari5 bringing you another video today. In today's video guys, uh, we're going to talk about LISC, the number 15 currency. But before that guys, let's take a quick look at the market. Refresh the page real quick. Bitcoin up 2.4%, up uh, 8,200. Ethereum, look at that monster moving. Up almost to 480, up 16%. Um, Bitcoin Cash down 4%, Ripple almost up a quarter. Dash up 5%. Dash is just being super consistent. Up, up almost to 600. Look at that. Litecoin freaking moving too. Up almost to 80. Almost meeting up with our analysis. Up 7%. Uh, Monero up to 2 point, almost 5%. Neo down almost a half a percent. Ethereum Classic up almost 20%. IOTA down 2%. NEM up almost 5%. Qtum up almost 3 Zcash up almost 13 Wow, Zcash starting to finally make some noise. List. The currency uh, for today's episode up almost six percent. When I was watching it, it was over earlier today. It was at seven fifty four. I should have probably bought, but oh well, it's cool. Um, Cardano, hey, there we go, up two point three percent, seven percent. I was just looking at the charts for this. This is looking very, very bullish in my opinion. Um, I think within the next three days, it's gonna at least. Hmm. This is a very bold statement, but I feel like this will be at least. Four. That's just my personal opinion. But um, next three days, let's say 24, 27. Don't quote me on that, but that's just me. Lumen's down uh, almost half a percentage. Uh, but all right, guys, really quick, let's take a look at Bitcoin before we make our way to list. Uh, JP Morgan scandal, you know, when they got caught that money laundering up. What a coincidence, guys. Uh, three days ago, JP Morgan is weighing the Bitcoin futures, whether they want to offer them to their clients or not. We all know that's gonna happen. You know, if you say no, all the you know, all the investors they all just move to another bank and just do it that way. You know, you lose money if you don't do it. So you're gonna do it, obviously. You know, don't try to deny the fact. Uh, quick Bitcoin analysis, real quick. Looks like we have a new uptrend right here. Now that all this is happening, guys, I I'm just more and more convinced we're gonna hit our ten thousand the years over again that's just my personal opinion I'm no financial advisor but you know first JP Morgan money laundering so you can't trust the banks oh look now you want to offer you know the only way out from the banks why not well I mean not really because it's a future contract but whatever you know what I mean um, all right so let's take a look at our number 15 currency list up 5.9% Market cap 919 million. Uh, today's volume 33 million. Wow, that's a lot. Uh, circulating supply 115 million. So that's pretty low. Um, so what is this? Let's go ahead and take a look at their website. Close this. So, oh. all right. So list blockchain application platform. Download our wallet to join the list network. So the future potential of the list platform. Three simple steps towards your own blockchain application. Step one, code. Step two, keep sold. Step three, use. So basically what it is, it's an, uh, and I took a couple of notes here earlier this morning, because uh, the reason I'm making today's video is one of the one of my viewers asked for, um, you know, list. So this one's for you. But um, what I wrote down is list is basically an app software development. So um, the kit they're going to be promoting, and it's actually going to be, I believe, coming out. Uh, first quarter of 2018 is their SDK kit. Um, it's basically what Lisk is. It's a decentralized app app platform, um, and you're able to program it in JavaScript from front end to back end, which is pretty cool. Um, and the cool thing about the apps on the blockchain is they're all decentralized, right? Cool. Let me put hold on just a second. And oh, also that this is actually yeah, this was this was with, uh, the cool one to me. So, uh, because you own a Lisk wallet, you're actually, you know, the Lisk uh, coin wallet holder, so you actually have to have the coins, um, you actually get a vote uh, to maintain, like, the network and stuff like that. Um, that's something that I've uh, found pretty interesting. But uh, these are some collaborations that they have. Newsletter, if you want to subscribe to them, let's go ahead and take a look at the Learn More page. Become a pro. So nowadays we have Apple's App Store and Google Play Store, both centralized solutions owned by corporations for centralized applications. The List Foundation believes in a decentralized future. In order to achieve this, List strives to uh, make blockchain technology accessible for 
everybody by building a blockchain application platform. Likewise for users and developers. On May 24, 2016, the uh, LISK blockchain network went live with its own cryptocurrency called LISK, or LSK, sorry. From that date, the LISK Foundation is working hard together with the contractors towards the release of their software development kit, SDK. The SDK is a framework written in JavaScript to deploy your own uh, blockchain network next to the main LISK network. Decentralized applications can be built on top of your own blockchain. So that's pretty sick. So basically, you're able to build your own app or whatever it is you want to build right next to the list network so you're you know you have your, you're basically your own network which is cool you know it's like its own little side chain possibilities are endless like developing platform independent social networks messenger games and so on all on your own blockchain network including your including your own corresponding token fully decentralized and all of this without the hassle of complicated consensus algorithms of peer to peer network protocols mm, interesting so newsletter if you want to subscribe, blog if you want to read that, documentation, uh, FNQ, go ahead and click on that. Let's see, so what's the common question that someone would probably have? Mm. Well, let's start with the general. <laughs> Let's get the blockchain application platform established in 2016 based on its own blockchain network and network, blockchain network and token LSK. List will enable developers to create, distribute, and manage decentralized blockchain applications by de developing their own sidechain linked to the LIST network, including a custom token. Thanks to the flexibility of sidechains, developers can implement and customize their blockchain applications entirely. So that pretty much goes over uh, what the Learn More page had. Um, but uh, the cool thing about LIST guys is they actually just had a meeting uh, two days ago, um, and it's basically them like announcing their the rebranding and they said to expect it around February 20th uh, 2018 so next year coming up very very soon um, and the cool thing about this like I said earlier is also to expect uh, during the first quarter of 2018 is their SDK uh, kit to be released so um, with that be, uh, being said they're also bringing um, their web and desktop app so um, that's gonna be pretty cool and the wallet's supposed to be integrated into uh, that app so that'll be pretty interesting um, but that's uh, pretty much what I got for uh, LISK and LSK is the currency or the token we'll be trading so let's go ahead and take a look here at the charts here we're looking at LSK to BTC BTC weekly so right away I see we have a pretty solid double bottom well, what I like to call actually a whammy double bottom because this is bottom one and this bottom right here is slightly higher than this bottom so that's a good indication to me that we want to move up this is the weekly still so you know we still have what two days before this candle closes um, so it's not a for sure yet but something out here let's go ahead and move on to the daily anymore I was just kind of showing you guys what I see right there so daily shows me a nice little uptrend At the same time it's a pretty strong downtrend possible <laughs> Looks like we have a huge W. Except it came a little short. No signs of bullish momentum yet, but this is just the daily, the four hour. As you can see here, this is, we are bouncing off support here. Um, looks like we have a pretty solid support around 876. Remember, we're in BTC, not US dollars. Um, let's go ahead and take a look at the four hour. I'm sure there is a, an entry point. Or at least a sign of one coming. So you could technically enter here and have your stop loss here, or not your stop loss, you know, you're not trading it, you're investing. Well, at least personally, I'm investing. Um, but I would probably wait 
for a confirmation I'd probably wait for this to break through and come up to here and come back down to find support so this is what I'm expecting I'm, or waiting for I'm expecting for a move here a move down and then a move back up where I want to get in so I'm getting in here I'll be getting in around here I, so it's that's what I mean technically you could get in right now and you'd be getting at the same time but this is just me playing it safe to make sure we go up um, I'll probably take a small position in right here right now and then wait for the confirmation and just take my you know bigger position um, where do I see this going let's see let's go ahead and switch back over to the daily I definitely believe this this uh, company or coin is very undervalued you know bringing the blockchain to your phone you know is ridiculous in my opinion it is not ridiculous but I love the idea you know it's it's I love it so um, I'm I, I like this company I find it very interesting um, so I'm just with the idea of the company I'm, I'm bullish already you know would I buy now probably not just actually you know now that I'm looking at it a little bit more it looks like we have this is the daily it looks like we have we're, we're, we tested support and we found support actually so it looks like we could possibly just start moving up I don't think we're gonna have resistance give me a second Yeah, I don't believe we come back down. If we come, if I, uh, if not this candle, but the next candle closes above 10, what is that? Oh, 108,329. Um, I'm probably going to take another entry. It looks like we're going to continue. I don't see this slowing down. Four hours showed me, you know. Like it found support. Our looks showed me a nice double bottom here. I think we might be coming back up to test that the top of the this downtrend here. But I'd probably take a small position now. Like I said earlier, wait for the confirmation and then take my full position. I do expect this to come up here, test the 1.5 level or sorry, 0 0.0015 level. And after that, once we do make our correction to find support, again here maybe at uh, 00112, um, I do expect us to make the move to 00180. And um, from there, I believe we won't see a correction. I feel like we'll possibly just break all the way through and then come back down to find support. But that's uh, we're not there yet, so we're going to wait for that. But that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, comment, like. Uh, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I'll leave my links down below. Uh, don't forget to comment what, what what kind of videos you guys are trying to see. Seems like you guys really like the technical analysis. So I'm going to stick to that. Uh, but thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy. Peace.